Hi, and welcome to Stamp with Ginny. Today I'm going to share with you a fun technique using my Brusho Crystal Colors and Saran Wrap. So let me set this aside and we'll get started. Okay, the first thing you're going to want to do is punch a hole with a push pin to get started. I like to use an older um, piece of grid paper because this is a messy technique and you'll want to be able to set it aside for dry time and to just toss it into the trash when you're done. So I've got a piece of glossy cardstock here, it's a quarter of a sheet, and I have got my heavy starch spray and I am getting that ready. So the first thing I'm going to do is shake that can up and then I'm going to start spraying and I'm doing this fairly close and fairly heavy so that I've got a lot of liquid starch on my paper. Once I have that done, I'm going to take a little of my yellow and I'm going to sprinkle it across the top. Some of the orange in the center, or the gabage, I'm not real good with foreign languages, so I'm probably saying that incorrectly, and then some of my brilliant red. And at that point, I'm going to take some saran wrap or plastic wrap, and I'm going to pull about 12 inches to 18 inches off of my roll and then just kind of crumple it up in a random pattern. Now the longer the piece you have the more crinkles you're going to get so it really is a personal preference and once I get that down I am going to lay it on top of my cardstock and just kind of pat it and then I am going to be patient and set it aside to dry about 15 to 20 minutes Okay, the time has elapsed, and so we're ready to take the saran wrap off of our cardstock. Okay, remember it's going to look a little different each time depending on how much brush oil you put on, how you crinkle your saran wrap. So now that I've got the saran wrap off, I am ready to allow this to finish drying. Since it's not completely dry yet, the 20 minutes just allows it to set up and let that spray starch do its thing. So let me show you the original again. I've trimmed it and mounted it onto my card front. If you'd like any of these products, feel free to stop by my online store. It's open 24-7 and you can get there from my blog, Stamp with Ginny. Thanks for joining me.